Hey y'all, this is Christy from Teen Idols. It's time for Motivational Monday. And today, I don't feel very motivated. <laughs> I have tried to do this video so many times. I had something in my head I wanted to say today and wanted to talk about today. And I cannot get my brain to focus on it for nothing. And uh, some days it's just like that. I went to gym today for the first time in two weeks. Uh, and I'm very tired. And, uh, but I want to do a video because I haven't, it's going on, I know two weeks I didn't do a video and I didn't want to start a third week not doing a video. I enjoy doing these videos, but sometimes it gets to the end of the day. Uh, that's why I was, was doing it on Sunday, but I got off that routine. Uh, I don't re even remember why I got off that routine, honestly. It just happens sometimes, okay? Life happens. And, uh things don't go the way I think they should go or the way I planned them to go but does anybody's life ever work out that way <laughs> is anybody out there saying everything goes the way I planned it and the way I wanted to go I don't think so I really don't think that happens to anybody if you if you're a anomaly out there let me know uh an anomaly anomaly I can't say that word right now <laughs> I'm too tired my, my mouth don't want to work and say that word so, I know that sometimes, I watched something today that was talking about getting chores done. And it was just talking about how, how you do and don't do a chore is not, is morally neutral. I believe that's the term they used. Uh, which I had never thought about before. Because a lot of people think that if you don't have this done or that done, or this tidied up or this this way or that way, then you're failing at your life. <laughs> and uh, basically it was about giving yourself a break on that. I mean, you know, we're all doing the best we can do. And who decided that it should be this way or that way anyway? I have to find the way that works best for me and in my life right now to get things done uh, because there's certain things I don't want to do because I don't like doing it. But is there a way I can do it that would make me less, make it like, make me like it a little more? Or is there something I can do in a way or do it in a way that works better for me that helps me get something done or, you know, on days when I, I really don't feel like I got the energy to get the dishes done or something. I, I gave up a long time ago. I try to keep them done every day, but you know what? If it don't get done every day, uh, there's usually a reason. Usually it's because I'm, I was busy doing other stuff. And I always don't pile up like, you know and become a health hazard. Is it really that big of a deal? I don't think it is. I really don't think it is. Because um, I don't have a dishwasher. It's not like I can just hide them in the dishwasher to like, get ready to turn it on. I can't do that. So, uh, I try to learn to give myself a break on that my house should lo look this certain way. Because I, I think a lot of us feel like that sometimes. Because we see whatever on social media you know you see all these people having things a certain way and looking a certain way or being a certain way but how many people's lives are really like that that's just internet fakeness i guess internet beauty i don't know how else to put that so um and currently i have two dogs that are older one is almost 16 and one is 10 which one's a Jack Russell. The little one is almost 16. And he is, he cannot hold his mess. <laughs> like, at all. <laughs> if he's going, he gotta go, he's gotta go. He can't wait. He's not gonna wait. And so I am constantly cleaning up after him. Because I cannot keep up with when he's gonna go out and when he doesn't want to go. He could be dead asleep. And I can walk in the other room and come back in there and he's done made a mess in the floor went and laid back down 
or sometimes you don't even make it out of his bed. I know that's not a very lovely topic to talk about, but, uh, and then my older dog, my bigger dog, has urinary tract problems that just will not go away. And so when they have to stay, like today, they had to stay longer than usual before going back out because I went to the gym after work and my son doesn't get home till later. So it's always a mess. It's always a mess to clean up. I am so tired of cleaning up those messes. <laughs> I am doing the best I did, can do to stay on top of it. Uh, and I feel like I cleaned up a lot this weekend to try to make, you know, just... Uh, and it just seemed like it just <laughs> did me no good. <laughs> so, while this may not be motivating to get up and go do something, I'm hoping that this is motivating to give yourself a break sometimes um, we all do a lot most of us do anyway we all have a lot going on in our lives uh, we're all doing the best we can do most of the time and if you feel like you're not doing the best that you can do maybe look at why 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 can't you why do you feel like you can't do that uh, sometimes it just seems too hard Seems like you got no energy for it. But sometimes if you look at it in a different way, like what can I do that would make this less stressful for me, that would make me want to do it? Or just uh, the lady in the video I watched, her thing was folding up clothes. And see, I don't have a problem folding up clothes. I actually enjoy folding up clothes. That's just something I enjoy doing. But there are other chores I, I don't enjoy doing, okay? Uh, like cleaning the bathrooms. I don't like doing that. Uh, but it has to be done. And uh, I, I don't enjoy doing that at all. Uh, washing dishes is not awful, but when I'm tired, I really don't want to deal with it. Um, but for her, it was folding clothes, and she realized, because she has babies and little kids and all that stuff, that, you know she could just get bins and stuff and toss stuff in it versus folding it up because most of it was not there was no reason to be folding it up for her you know and it made her life a lot easier and it made her not dread doing those things right I love folding clothes actually I love to fold them up neat and not tidy you can see by my fabric shelf back here I like to fold things and have them neat and tidy. That's just a thing for me. Um, but some things, like the bathroom, it just grosses me out. <laughs> I don't like doing it. So I try to find ways to do it or things I can do, utilize that make that less gross for me. Because I'll put it off because I don't want to do it. I'm sure y'all do things like that too, right? I put things off because I don't want to do it because you don't enjoy doing it. Even though it needs to be done. So, there are things you can do like those self, the, the, the little tabs you put in the toilet to help clean it. You know, which works okay if you don't have a, a guy living with you, I guess. <laughs> no, they don't seem to last for that. I gotta find something better for that. But anyway, I don't mean to be getting talking about toilets and dog poops and stuff. But <laughs> I just want y'all to know that my life is not like put together and just fabulous all the time. If if anybody thinks that or sees that or or uh, no, it's not. Uh, I spent a great deal of time cleaning up here lately, and it is exhausting. And then I have all this stuff I need to do to my house. I got to fix siding and paint it and I need my yard work done and you know it's just there's always something to do. It's just a cycle. Some things are cycles. They talked about that too like the laundry is never done. You're always gonna have to do it but that means you got clothes to wear right? Dishes are never done. They're always gonna be more dishes to wash but that just means you had food to eat. You know that kind of thing. Uh, something that's always going to have to be done. So finding a way to do it that's easier for you and lets that task get better. 
Like for me, when I wash dishes, I listen to music or I find a YouTube video I want to listen to or watch while I'm washing dishes. So, while I'm just washing and listening. I make it go by faster, right? Um, so, that's my motivational video <laughs> for today. <laughs> uh, just things aren't always what they seem. So, be easier on yourself, okay? Um, I hope y'all have a wonderful week. Go make something pretty and have a life lived creatively. I'll see y'all later. Bye.